If you're like me, summertime means hitting the lake for some wakeboarding, water skiing, and camping. And the odds are that the lakes and dams you visit are owned and operated by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, as they are the number one provider of recreational sites. Mary Cochran reports that the Corps uses their more than 15,000 square miles of lakes to power more than just summer sports. Liquid power. H2O provides 20% of the world's electricity. It's the cleanest and one of the most cheap forms of uh, power that's, that's available uh, to anybody, anywhere. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers owns and operates 75 hydroelectric plants across the U.S. This one at Wolf Creek Dam generates power serving nine states. Well, this facility operates with no cost to the taxpayer. The power that we produce is sold to cover the cost of operation of this facility. Hydroelectricity produces no pollution or waste, and it's more reliable than solar or wave power. That mechanical energy from that falling water is what we're using as it comes from the lake to the river. It's falling a distance of 160 feet. So as it moves through the pipe, which we call a penstock, it rotates the turbine, the turbine rotates the generator, and the generator produces electricity. Liquid power, it's the number one renewable energy resource. Mary Cochran, Kentucky.